Ooh, we got a buttload of fish on the screen. Holy cow. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Nebraska. Uh, so we, today we actually, well, we're gonna be doing a three day ordeal. Uh, got out onto some private ponds out in north west Nebraska and really looking forward to it. We're already on one. Um, just kind of a tiny little hole basically you already got some fish on the ice because you know how i am kind of dumb when it comes to getting stuff figured out before i get going but anyway potentially got the opportunity to catch perch bluegill bass possibly catfish not really sure we're just trying to figure it out so where we're kind of staying is about right up in there uh it's a little trailer cabin shack little deal so stay tuned stick with us this should be a fun weekend oh my God. Come up and take a sniff. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Oh my God, I missed him. Stay there. Crap. Ah, oh, that's just my luck. Got him. What we got? Ooh, nice bluegill. All right, couldn't see the bait because there's a flipping fish on it that I couldn't see. It's kind of nice to be in Nebraska and not have to wear like heavy gear. Gosh, these last couple of months have been brutally cold. Gosh, dang it. Come eat it. Come over and take a snave. Oh, scared him off. We're kind of being able to stay on them, but really your best bet is popping down and just letting them come to you because they're swimming, swimming through in schools. And, and right now there's a buttload of fish on the screen, but it, uh, a lot of bluegill. Um, you know, we caught that bass right away, but that was, that was it for the big of fish. Flipping eat it. Oh, oh gosh, dang it. And the wind is dying down. Thank God. Gotta get down and catch some crap here. Oh, you freaking thing. Come on. Holy nuts. That's a lot of fish. Got him. Oh, no. What are you? School of crappie. That's what these are. Yeah, they're not bad. I was wondering if that's what these things were. Little butt darts. Come over and take a snave. Come on, you suckers. Got him. Dang, this is a nice one. Holy cow. I got a, I got a school of crappie if you want to catch him. God, there's got to be... Nick, there's probably... There's every bit of, like, 200 fish right here. All right, dropping down into the school. It's not going to take long. Oh! <laughs> and... Doink! Woo! <laughs> Dude, just get over here. That didn't take long. Uh, anywhere, just within like 10 feet of me. You could probably go like literally five to 10 feet and you'll like right there and you'll be fine. I mean, look at them. Like a damn whale. Yeah. I always drill separate holes. Yeah, I've done that too. I just gotta, I gotta see if I can get this on camera. This is absolutely insane. So obviously you can see the bottom is solid red, but everything in between, oh, come on screen. Everything in between here is a school of crappie. And there's a lot of them. A guy could literally like plop a hut down right here and I'd be perfectly okay with that. It was a kick-ass sunset though. Wow. Good morning, folks. And welcome to Nebraska. And welcome back to Ski Outdoors. My name is Jake and uh, today is going to be a day. We're out here in uh, northwest Nebraska and last night we got on a very good crappie bite but there is a lot more potential in the bodies of water that we'll be fishing. Small ponds, kind of new for me but kind of isolates the fish a little bit so that should be nice but uh, yeah we got five guys that are going to be on the ice today. I'm excited. 
this is a new venture we have potential to catch more crappie thank god and then bass and hopefully hopefully the elusive perch stick with us stay tuned we'll see you on the ice all right so this is kind of the beauty of this little slice of heaven it uh well here i'll just kind of show you hey it's a beautiful sunrise but here's pond number one as you can see pretty tiny but where we're going which is about that way a good hop skip and a jump gets a little bit bigger but it is just absolutely beautiful out here and i can't wait this is new this is new for me and uh i can't appreciate the people that have let me come out here to do this and i thank you so much for letting me so yeah it's gonna be a day all right we're here gotta go down up on the dam here but look at that beauty Woo! this is a little steep it might not be able to justify it on the uh oh gopro here but dude this it's a little ways down here we go folks all right so we got two sleds out on the ice going back to get the other two guys that we left at the old shack uh just because oh well, they had to clean up food so thanks for doing that but um anyway so we just drilled a hole quick just to make sure like hey let's get on fish found them boom instantly <sighs> it's such a good feeling and uh yeah so when we get back i would say it's gonna be fishing but it might be a lot of catching here we go first cast they're coming in come on baby come on come on come on come on come on come on oh no that was a good one oh my god son of a nutcracker got one oh yeah here we go oh yes nice perch nice perch oh crap there's still more down there jeez i'm sitting here goofing off here we go here we go here we go baby come on come on come on come on come on come on let's go let's go there he is oh this is a better one. Oh baby oh, oh boy what do we got nice heck yeah check it out Whew. Notes, Ricky, or are you going to wait for the YouTube video to come out? <laughs> I don't want to watch him on YouTube. <laughs> Jacob's trying to show everybody the professional way of doing it. Well, I gave you guys an opportunity to capitalize on this school, so I figured I'd better come over and yeah. <laughs> help out. That's about right. Oh, here comes the school. Come on, baby. Holy cow, there is a buttload of fish. All right, small update. So I found perch. I even had to get the old camera out, which hopefully I'll be able to show you some underwater footage. No, I did not catch any, but I found them, which was a good thing. The thing about it is we're kind of on Struggle Bus City and I, I'm not 100% sure why, but it could be a multitude of things. Like last night was really, really good, but um, I have a feeling that it's going to be a night bite kind of like it was last night because these fish watching them on the camera they just it's like ugh. and the other guys uh we probably got close to 40 crappie in between the four other guys over there so it's good um i kind of went on a solo mission out here just to see if i could find the perch which i did success in its own respect but yeah that's kind of where we're at better than work there he is Money. That's a nicer one. Yeah, do you have a bucket full of fish already down here? That was no, I just got the perch that I caught earlier. But what I'm going to do is get them out on the ice and be like, we're catching perch. <laughs> Jim would shit himself. Come here. Okay. Hey, look, it's the same one. Oh, get out of there. This is not good. Ah, frick. GoPro, start recording. What is going on?
got him. Oh, spider. Oh, this is a better one, whatever it is. Yes. Heck yeah. Here we go. Oh my god. Oh, he wanted it. What are you? Go figure. It's a delicious place. Delicious. Oh, where he hooked the crappie right in the noodle. Man, I swung and missed that one, and then he came back and just bam. God dang it. He just got a little taste. The Lutz of Bias. Good morning. Welcome to day two ish, kind of. It's actually like two and a half because we got here late on Thursday. So today's Saturday, which, folks, look at this. This is a beautiful, beautiful day. No wind yet. It's supposed to come up, but today we are going to pond number three. We uh, fished the one down here and then the one way down there. And we've, we've had success. So, I mean, we're coming home with fish, which is a great problem to have. Time not wasted, but still, like the view back here, it is unreal. It's a, uh, it's, it's beautiful country. Uh, and if you've never came to Nebraska, wherever you live, it's worth it. So come visit Nebraska. You won't be disappointed, but uh, stick with us today. Today on this top pond is what it's called. Supposedly there's pretty much everything in it. <laughs> bass, crappie, perch, uh, so whatever we catch, it'll be a bonus. Sure about that, Gary? <laughs> I just gotta look behind me and make sure I don't throw it down a damn hole again. Well, I'm trying to learn how this panoptics works. This is the biggest pike I have ever caught. 